My name is Eric Pilander. I'm 37 and I'm working with BHO Legal. I was working on matters related to general international law at the Institute of Air and Space Law with Professor Hober. However, I has not been concerned with space law at all. And then he asked me or rather forced me to do a project on space law, namely moot court. And uh, yeah, then I recognized the fascinating area of law. From there, I moved to the legal department of the German Space Agency and from there to BHO legal. During the last years, we are witnessing that matters in relation to space sustainability become more and more important. Whilst at the beginning, it has rather been an yeah, academic topic, it's more and more uh, of importance in practice. Whether it uh, concerns providing legal advice to lawmakers on developing rules on space sustainability, or whether it concerns applying such rules by lawmakers um, in licensing procedures as regards uh, private clients uh, providing legal advice uh, on adherence to the mm -hmm. requirements on space sustainability. Uh, and last but not least, uh, there are more, more projects which are dedicated to space sustainability measures such as honorable servicing and active debris, debris removal or um, space traffic management. Talking as a um, lawyer and as a practitioner, first of all, yeah, practice means practicing. So get as much practical insights as possible. And especially working in the space sector, though a lawyer will not become an engineer and will not become a market analyst, um, it's quite important to be familiar with the technologies and the markets you are dealing with. So not just gaining legal insights, but also understand the technologies and markets you are dealing with as a lawyer.